Thank you, because my phone rang. So my waist, I'm gonna connect up to my shoulders. So I'm gonna just kind of draw up to the arms eyes. My hips, I'm gonna spread out to hip line. And then it comes back to bikini bottom line. My thighs, I'll probably stick right in here. My ankles, this is midpoint of my ankle, so I'll probably swoop it in at the ankle, out at the calf, back in at the knee, right? And just put spades on here for feet because I don't know how to do shoes. Arms, I just kind of decide. And then a little fingertips. Does that make sense? And I've drawn a person that's more proportionate than any stick person I've ever drawn in my entire life. It's crazy to me that I could make that actually look like the outline of a person. And what happens if you wanna bend their arms, if you wanna do any of those kind of things, then that'll change like what happens from elbow to wrist. And if you kilt their shoulders, that might happen, change what happens with their upper arm. But this just kind of gives you an idea now, the other thing, so I'm going to draw another face here, and I'm just going to quadrant the face in force. And then I'm going to quadrant it in half this way. Okay, so if I were to draw a face in here, this first line up here is my brow line. My eyes are gonna come in right here. My nose is gonna come in right here. My mouth is gonna be down here. My chin is down here. My ears are right here on this center point. Then it just kind of proportions out my face. I'm not gonna draw one because this is what it ends up looking like. I'm still like a smiley face kind of person. I'm impressed my stick figure skills have progressed at least to this point. Okay, 